My name's Sarah Chapman. I'm the founder of the Townsville STEM Hub. I decided many years ago that something needed to be done in terms of STEM engagement, so science, technology, engineering and mathematics, in Townsville and North Queensland. The reason for that is we have nationally and internationally recognised uh, STEM organisations in our region, yet they're not championed and they're not celebrated. And there's a lot of wealth of knowledge and expertise here, yet we don't celebrate it as a community. In terms of the Townsville STEM Fair, this is the first event of many to come that is involving the community. This is called the Robotics Experience at the Townsville STEM Fair today and uh, students are actually having fun playing with robots. They're using the iPads to program the way that they move. They got sensors, ultrasonic sensor and the colour sensor and they're reacting to those using the programming. In terms of the bigger picture, what, what we want to do is just give kids an opportunity to tinker, to play um, and get kids excited about robots and get excited about programming. Uh, today we're at the Townsville's first STEM fair and um, here we're just letting kids fly drones um, just so they can get excited about technology and some of the things they may be able to do as jobs in the future. As it burns, the stuff it makes is actually a lot bigger. I'm Dr Graham Walker, I'm a science communicator and science show performer. I do these shows because they're a great way to share science, they're a great way to inspire young people. We have a countdown from five, four, three, two, one. The, the future of work is going to be really different and there's a lot of modelling at the moment that shows that you know certain jobs are going to taper off, um, other jobs are going to expand. And jobs with you know your science, technology, engineering and maths, they're, they're the, the future of where, where the job market's going to go. Um, programs like what we're doing at the STEM Fair are really critical to open people's eyes, especially young people's eyes. I meet people um, at university who've come to something like this as a young person and it's been that little thing that sent them off on that tangent that, that can be so inspiring. Those young people are the future scientists, the future engineers that, that, that Australia is going to need if it wants to keep up. Downsizes all your electronics and makes them non-branded. So basically you draw up... Hi, my name's Tristan Fivers, I'm in Grade 8 and I'm 14 years old and I have created a smart mailbox that sends your phone notifications when you have mail. So this is my mailbox. Um, it can power itself indefinitely as the solar panel is constantly recharging a 12-volt lithium battery. An Arduino D1 Wemos mini board, a breadboard and a small computer fan. Up here there is a pressure sensor. So basically if something drops down onto it, it will um, send data to an app that I made called um, Mail Sensor Notifications. It's all ready and plugged in. I just slip the mail through and on my phone it'll tell me that I have mail. In conclusion, thank you for submitting your photographs of STEM and how it is a part of your life. Townsville STEM Fair has been an ultimate success. We have had an absolutely wonderful turnout. All of the events have actually been packed to the rafters. We have had an excellent response to our Townsville STEM Fair. We're looking forward to doing a lot more in terms of STEM and community engagement in the future. Uh, stay tuned and look at the Townsville STEM Hub Facebook page, Twitter or Inspiring Australia website.